Um, wait, is that Dar I can't tell if this is real or not. If Darren, if that's you and you want to be in our lives, send another request. Um, I don't want to just say yes to someone pretending to be you, and I can't tell. Uh, do you guys remember playing a post show set in some girl's dorm room after your Fillmore show in 2007? Yeah. Yes, very, very well, actually. That's yeah, really funny. Um, let's see what else we got. Booty hole tunes, Gil says. That's funny as well. Um, Al, I think, I think, I'm not positive, but I think Darren Chris wanted to be in the live. If I can't tell if it was him. Let me see. Be request. Yeah, it really is. Okay. Darren, if you're still there, I'm, I'm accepting you. Booyah. Uh, um, why don't you guys play After Hours or Leader? Do you guys ever go over this song? Darren Chris. Yo, guys. <laughs> Two I have so much Darren. to say. Yeah. Two I'm Darren's rarely on Instagram. I'm rarely on Instagram. <laughs> rarely. But I saw this and I was like, ooh, fun. I, here I am. And I don't want to flatter myself by joining your thing, but it kept, I kept saying shit and it would come in like way later. But you answered all the questions I want to hear. And I want to hear the answer to the storm question. Did you play the storm in 2007? Did you see that? There was a question that said, do you guys remember playing a dorm yeah. after the show? It sounded like you were saying storm and you confused That's, Darren and me. That's oh, do, yeah, the storm. There was stormy outside. It was raining. We, we played the storm. The storm. No, I do remember 2007 near the Fillmore. In San Francisco? In San Francisco. Because I was I remember fucking what? there. So I'm like, where was I? But it's probably if you college, were there, actually. why don't I re remember you being there? Wait, you were, you were at the show, but you didn't go to the after. No, that, that's what you're saying. 2007 yeah. doesn't track. I probably, was, I probably was in college. I was probably out of town. I just associated the Fillmore with... If you guys played the Fillmore, I was there. But if it was in the years I was living in Ann Arbor, Michigan, then no. Um, the only reason why I'm joining is because uh, you were uh, saying something that I thought... I, and I'm flattering myself here because I'm just... I'm fangirling listening to you guys. But I thought it would behoove any other fans here that should know that my very effusive uh, fandom life with you guys that I, I've, I've never minced words about with either of you about how much I adore you guys and the band. I, it kind of st uh, start my, I, I crossed the threshold of super fan to actually somewhat getting to be homies with you guys. The, the nexus of this was when I was put on my very, very first co-write, which is as you very diplomatically tried to articulate Alex, you know, it's, it, it's a hit or miss thing and you're being very polite about it. But, you know, it's like a weird, for those of you that are watching this that do music, it's like a weird ecosystem. It's not yeah. always just like, we're going to write a song. Sometimes it's like, a, it, most of the time it's like a blind date. It's odd. But I like weaseled my way into this because I was talking about how much I fucking love Fan and Planet. And Podwall was like, oh yeah, I don't know those guys. Like, I'll get you a room with, it was you and with Ferrar. Yeah. And I'm like 22. I just moved to LA and I was like, Holy shit! This is my fucking chance. Like I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna I'm gonna be in fan of planet. This is it, guys. <laughs> and I didn't know like anything. I'd never been in a car before. I didn't know how it works. I didn't know because by that point, I was you know on my way as like a singer songwriter, having you know I just do everything on my own. The idea of sitting down with other people was like foreign, much less people that I idolized. And I just remember being in there, being like. This is like great, but um, and I love this guy, but I only, I don't think, uh, I don't think it's working. <laughs> I think I'm, I don't think this is a great idea, not because of you, but because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, uh, which is different. I think we've we've had some better musical times since then, but I just thought that would behoove people to know. Yeah, my first well, experience with you, Alex, was at in Ferrar's like garage studio, and I didn't really know how to like do the thing you know well also like adding to your self unass doubting unassuredness uh we didn't know what we were doing right. either like right which you told me later and i was like oh thank god exactly <laughs> but i think there's something there really is something to be said about us having well especially you but well also especially us but like having the courage to just it, get into a creative situation with somebody you don't know. 
Yeah. Where you don't not date. Go on the blind date. Yeah. And maybe it's a great, maybe it's somewhere in between great and not great. Yeah. It's wild. Uh, but I'm also happy that we did that and we should be doing more of that. We should. And I'm happy that that was sort of the start of us being closer to one another and being friends. Yeah. Eventually. It, it was. It wasn't until like a while later, I think when you guys were, were very, I, you know, it's a combination of me kind of, I still don't really know my head from my, my ass, but I'm getting closer. I think I know, the distance is becoming shorter. Uh, <laughs> where we've gotten to hang out and play some music and it's, it's a lot more fun because I think I just have more experience with what I'm doing. But anyway, I thought it was an interesting question. People were asking you if you've co-write. And, and I know that's like a sometimes thing, but uh, I, I felt like it was an interesting story to to share. That's that's all I really got, Fan and Planet fans. Well, A, love that you <clears throat> came and chimed in, and B, I do think that's an important thing to like express, which we probably don't or haven't hammered in well, is that anybody can be creative, and you can be really beyond what you thought your creativity could be, working with other perspectives and other people, and we don't usually do that as often as we probably when i say that humanity does not do that as yeah, often as I, it usually aside of writing songs just in general collaboration yes yeah, is, is a good is a good thing this is it's got collabs? very deep yeah collabs yeah. Like, like spiritual collabs political collabs you know like on a grander level from writing songs i i, I i'm so what you're spilling i think i gotta go now i think it's I, uh I, this is this is why much well let's um I, I would love to leave you with, with this to ponder. Please. The more we as a species, the more we as, a, as humanity can leave out a middleman, the better. The better. I would, would agree. Okay. Unless that middleman is doing the thing that I, I really don't want to do. Unless, yeah. I, or that we're the middleman. <laughs> Unless we're doing it and we need a job. We need a middleman job. Yeah. Um, hey, you guys are playing shows in New York. Yeah, I'm in New York right now. Yeah. So hopefully I'll, I'll be one Please of those. Be if be, not, be our places. guest. Twenty twenty fifth is when we're playing the the real yeah. show. Yeah, right. the much delayed one, right? Because you guys were supposed to do another one that got parlayed. I got to hang on Instagram more often. This is very cool. I get to see people that I like. If all the pictures and things that I've taken when I've gotten to play with you guys, which is like the kind of shit that when I was a kid would have blown my mind, is the kind of shit that most people would like post about to high hell. I have so many cool selfies and videos. I just they just sit on my phone. Yeah, they just. I, I don't have the time or mind to go on Instagram to, to share them, but I have them. So maybe this is a good gateway into the social media world, which I spend very little time. A on. good middleman, if you will. Yeah, if I had a middleman that could do that. So uh, <laughs> hit me up on Instagram if you guys want to be my middleman. Uh, you know, <laughs> get, get a job. All right, I'll leave you guys to it. Uh, hey, in... Fan Planet Rolls, you guys are the fucking best. Lead to talk Thanks to for letting me join. Okay. See you in New York. Yeah. Peace. Hey, stay, man. <laughs> That's funny. What an angel. <laughs> He's a good man. Those Darren's, I tell you. Well, you're another Darren. That's what I'm saying. He's pretty good. Darren oh, Chris, God. great. He's Darren Chris. <laughs> this guy, eh, yeah. I don't know how yeah. I feel about it. Uh, well, that does open the doorway to who would like to do some collaborations with our band, which we have done with Darren Chris before. Send us a DM. Yeah. Should we play a song? Yeah. I'm gonna break. Should we well, play a song, break things up a little bit? Also, though, with the DMs, Darren and I are on Instagram at least for an hour every day. Yep. For take, yeah. If you guys want to do something fun, hit us up. Like, legitimately, writing-wise, hit us up. For all the people, by the way, saying Darren Chris, literal angel, he really is. He like, really is. He's a spe he's a very special person. behind the scenes. He's exactly the way he is on here. He he does not change. He's just the way he is. He's a really he's a good dude. Really good dude. Creatively and whatever philosophically, I don't know the way you're talking about him. He's an inspiration. He's a special dude. <laughs> <laughs> very special he's guy. He's funny as hell. Love him. Uh, but yeah, should we Dallin Weeks too? Yeah, Dallin from uh, I don't know how, but they found me. He uh, he's also very handsome, 
very talented, really great dude, big fan. Always um, an honor to have uh, extremely handsome and talented men being a fan of your band. I, I would agree. I would agree. Do you want to play a song or two? Are you in the mood? Or you just want to keep talking? Why don't we answer the next 30 seconds of questions, if there are any. 30 and then seconds. I'll tune my guitar. All right. And then we'll be good. All right. We're going to answer a couple questions. I'm just scrolling to see what we've got. I can only go back so far. Let's see. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I've met Darren several times, too, and he's incredible. He really is. He's super, super nice dude. Very talented, too. He's like crazy good guitar player too which is like he can act he's handsome and he plays great guitar like come on well so he's just he can play great human as well everything yeah incredible yes yeah. he's just a good dude um let's see something sharp 